Today I'm unboxing and giving away some Scott knee guards. That's the Soldier 2. That is the Grenade Evo. And so we've got five pairs of each of these pads to give away. That's 10 pairs of pads. Keep watching to the end of the video to see how you can win them. We've got the Soldier 2 knee guards and the Grenade Evo. So first, let's take a look at the Soldier 2. So the pads come in this netting that's really handy to keep them in when you're not riding. The Soldier 2 is Scott's lightest knee pad. So really lightweight, designed for all mountain riding, enduro, super comfortable, so you can ride all day long in them. You've got this breathable netting all over the back and actually through the front as well. You can see it's really see-through, really breathable. So super comfortable, super lightweight. You've got D3O material. That's what this knee guard's made from. So it's really malleable. You can see how you can really bend that. But on impact, that really firms up to give you that protection. They're asymmetrical, so that is the left knee pad. As you can see, it says there. So in here, have got the right one. You can see on the inside of your knee, you've got this EVA foam there as well, just to stop you from hurting your knee if you tap it against the top tube. So really good bit of foam on the inside. Like I say, asymmetrical, they're pre-curved, super comfortable to ride in. So the front of the pad, you've got that big Scott logo, and this is abrasion resistant on that knee guard. So stops it from ripping and also gives you that protection. A few little cool details like the Scott brand in there. You've got that D3O tag. These are strapless knee pads, so super lightweight, but also you've got this silicon band around the top to keep them nice and snug on your leg. The Soldier 2 is available in four different sizes, small up to XL, and as you can see, it's really lightweight, perfect for those all-day rides, and you'd even consider those for cross-country rides. Now we're going up to scale to the Grenade Evo, a bigger pad, much more suited to more aggressive riding, like downhill, enduro, and free ride. So let's compare the two pads. You can see the Grenade Evo, it's a bigger, bulkier pad, but it does offer that much more protection. Again, they're asymmetric. This is the right knee pad. You can see now you've got this non-slip sort of covering on the knee. Great for if you sort of land on something grippy, it's not gonna grab and pull that knee pad off your knee and also give you any sort of wrenching movements. Still got the D3O knee guard, so really thick now. You've got the EVA foam on both sides, so that's on the outside of your knee, you've got a big pad there. Also above your kneecap and one again on the inside and lower down. You've now got two straps as well, so one at the top, one at the bottom. The lower one sits just above your calf, so it really stops that pad moving around when you're pedaling. Also got that breathable net on the back, and this is perforated neoprene. So let's take a look at that D3O material that makes up the main part of this knee guard. So that's that familiar orange color, if you've ever seen D3O before. It's got proprietary technology, it's patented. You see it's really soft, really sort of pliable. If I push down slowly into that pad, it actually squashes quite a lot. However, on a big impact, it actually is so it's rate sensitive, so it really firms up straight away, gives it really good shock absorbing properties. Again, you've got that Scott logo on the front of the knee pad, extra abrasion resistance to make them nice and tough. They're tailored, so they're pre-curved to your knee to make them really comfortable and from stopping them moving around when you ride. Available in small, medium and large. So we've got the Soldier 2 and we've got the Grenade Evo. How would you choose which knee pad is right for you? Well, definitely for longer rides, this is a much lighter weight, breathable pad. The Grenade Evo, I can definitely feel there's a bit more bulk to it. The knee pad feels much thicker, so much more protection, even with that EVA foam around the inside and outside. What's the payoffs? Well, it's gonna be slightly warmer, it's gonna be less comfortable, so not so good for the big rides, but great for protection for downhill and enduro riding. So there you go, there's the Scott knee pads. This is the Soldier 2 and its big brother, the Grenade Evo. Don't forget, we're giving away five pairs of each of these, so follow the link in the description down below this video to be in with a chance. Click on the GMBN logo to subscribe if you haven't done already, and to see more videos like this, click over there for how to stop going over the handlebars, where you probably need some knee pads, and over there for how to check your bike after a crash. Give us a thumbs up if you like free swag.